Hello everyone, this is me, Satya here, and I'm back with the bonus love read. This reading is going to be for the sign of Pisces. I will be doing this reading for the signs that got the most views, which includes uh, Pisces and uh, a few more signs. So yeah, uh, topic of the reading is going to be the current energies of your person. So whoever it is that you're dealing with, we're going to tap into the current energy of your person, uh, how, what are they doing in their life, then what do they think about you and the connection that they have with you, plus messages from them. So stay tuned and uh, before I dive into the read, let me remind you, it's a general read, it may, it may not resonate with everyone out there, so always pick the signs and messages that resonate and so leave the rest. For personal reads, you can always reach out to me on my email ID in the description box. You can also check out other services that I offer as well in the description box. So fishies, let's see. What is the current energy of your person? What is it that they are thinking about the most? What are their two most dominant thoughts right now? When we are doing this read, let's tap into their energy, what's going on in their life. Let's find out. <clears throat> the hair fans, huh? This person is right now busy with the uh, some legal matters right now it can be regarding their love life it can be regarding their work and career path as well but yes this person is so caught up and so busy with something legal to deal with um marriage matters if if you are dealing with a person who is already married it can be that for them it can be a legal matter involving their career or work life as well uh their business or whatever it is that they do for a living uh it can be related to that as well so this is uh, one of the most dominant thought that this person has Let's see more cards here. Um, I feel like you know there, there must be something uh, uh, hectic going on in their life right now that they really need the strength to deal with. Um, they might be having a lot of issues regarding uh, some legal matters involving their career. I feel like you know, for majority of you, it, it is a career thing that is going on. Let's take uh, one card from the middle of the deck just to see the clarify for the two of uh, the cards here. What are their current energies right now? What is the most dominant thought that they have? Let's take a clarify for these two cards here. The fool. This person really wants to break free from something. Uh, it can be uh, them trying to break free from a situation that they are dealing with in their work front. Uh, they really want to have a life that they desire. Now, for some of you, like I said earlier, maybe you are dealing with a person who is in a marriage right now already with someone else. And if that's the case, they really want to uh, break free from that because they don't feel right being in that situation. So there is something that they're trying to break free from. It can be responsibility at their work front as well, which they really want to get rid of so they could enjoy their life, which they are finding very hard to do right now. Let's see how do they feel for you. What is it uh, that they have on their mind about you for you? What is it that they want with you? What is it that they feel for you? What is it that they have on their mind about you for you and for the connection that they have with you? Let's begin. They really want to start something beautiful with you, something passionate. They feel a lot of uh, uh, passion, excitement when it comes to you. But at the same time, it seems like you know they are finding it very hard to give you enough time. Right now, maybe you are having issues with your person because of their unavailability in this connection. But this is what they want. Maybe they are waiting to end this scenario so they could come forward and give, to, uh, give whatever they want to give to you. Let's see more cards here. They are waiting for the divine timing. I feel like you know there is some sort of responsibility that they have on their shoulder right now and they are working towards getting rid of it so they could come and enjoy their life with you. So this is their top priority right now. Maybe you feel neglected, ignored by a person, but that's going to last, uh, you know, maybe a couple of more days time. But then they will come towards you. They will give you what you want with them. Let's see one more card here. Uh, they will be coming in towards you. If uh, you are in no communication right now, this person really wants to pursue their connection with you. Maybe right now you don't see that because they are caught up in something shitty going on in their life right now, which is consuming their most of energy. Uh, when it comes to what they desire, they desire you, obviously. But at the same time, maybe it is going to take them time before uh, they, you know, they, they would need uh to end the situation before they could come towards you let's see one more card here uh they do see that this connection that they have with you is going to go successful uh they really want to have a future with you they believe that you are the one for them they are heavily depending on the divine timing when it comes to this uh, you know connection that they have with you um let's see what is it that they want you to know First, we are going to see their messages uh, with the tarot and then we will take some uh, message cards from them as well. So stay tuned and let's see what is it 
that they want you to know. Okay, so we have cards flying out from the deck. Let me pick up the cards there. Well, it's a Wheel of Fortune, the one that fell down here. So things are going to shift in this connection very quick. Then we do have Knight of Wands. Um, then we do have the High Priestess, the Magician, and Seven of Wands, Ten of Cups, Page of Cups. Now, even though maybe you are in no communication right now, uh, or they are not giving you enough time, they really want you to know something. Um, they desire you as much as you desire them. But right now, they're preparing themselves up so they could do what they want to do in this connection. Like I said earlier, there is something that they are dealing with right now, which they're trying to break free from, so they could pursue the connection with you. Now, um, it can be different for different people, whatever it is that is happening here. Let's take one more card here, because I feel like you know your person is manifesting you as much as you are manifesting them. Maybe you don't see that because of... Uh, uh, because of the way things are right now in the current situation in this connection because their per, their energies are kind of uh, mm, Missing in the connection when it comes to you uh, You might have been obsessing over them because of their lack of availability to you uh, Let's take one card for how do you feel for this person right now? Let's see. How do you feel for this person right now? What is the energy towards you uh, uh, from you towards them? You feel that you have no clarity what's going on. I want to know whatever it is happening. I really want to know what, why they are behaving a certain way. You have no clarity around them. And that's exactly what is causing you to suffer right now because you are unaware of what is going on in their life and you really want to know that. But with the Three of Souls always is the case that um, once things are discussed, brought up in the uh, you know open, in, 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 uh, in a way where you, are, you discuss everything, you share everything, things get resolved. So it, this pain that is causing right now because of their unavailability is not going to last for long. So just know that. So right now maybe you are hurt, but they are going to make up for it. So yeah, let's see what else. Um, let's take a card asking the question, how long will they take to come, come towards you? Ace of Pentacles wants to show up. Um, I feel like you know, they will come with the, something stable to offer. Uh, and for something stable to offer, they have to feel stable there. They have to be free mentally, physically, emotionally to give in and rest into this connection with you. But yes, let's see what can, uh, when can they, um, when can you expect coming, uh, them coming towards you and offer you something beautiful? Is it going to happen soon or is it going to take long? Six of Cups, um, I feel like you know it's going to happen soon. It can take you six, uh, it can take your person six days to, um, um, Six hours to six days time maybe because I feel like you know, this person really does miss you a lot. So maybe you are definitely on this person's mind heavily whether you see that or you don't. Let's see some messages coming from them. Let's see what do they want you to know. What is it that they want you to know? I choose to walk away or sit, stay silent but I'm badly affected. Now maybe because they are not talking to you, it's causing you to stress around it. You are feeling bad but at the same time they are feeling the same way as you are they are also affected uh i love the way you love me it feels so right this person really enjoys getting loved by you but at the same time you hate being neglected by them you are my sacred home to me so this person really values you a lot and this person enjoys being in your company they feel that this is something that they want in their love life maybe they don't say it you will get to know it once they are ready to give into this connection with you exactly the way you want which i could undo unsay a few things i said and did so this person really have uh, uh you know a few things to undo and say but uh they will they will i feel like you know with the passage of time as they make a move towards you things will get better between the two of you let's see some more messages coming from your person how uh, let's see what else do they want you to know <clears throat> their unavailability is definitely not what you want but this is exactly what you want i want to marry you wow so this person really wants to marry you and they want to come forward to propose you now for some of you i would suggest you to do a script around it you getting marriage proposal from this person and you shall get it use this time frame use this information use this magical words um Maybe you can you can uh, write something down as if like you know that person is uh, sending you a message. I want to marry you. Uh, you can start visualizing that. You can start you know feeling that vibe coming from your person, like you know where they want to marry you. And wow, like you know just let this come in. And uh, you can script around it. And especially if you are a manifesto yourself, 
just write it down i want to marry you coming from your person maybe you can take a screenshot of uh, you know uh, something made like that where you receive a message from your person name the person and then write down you know next to that i want to marry you and you on the receiving and you feel wow so do something about it be creative around you know trying to manifest whatever you desire with your person so wow let's see one last card from their you know their uh uh you know their heart to your heart i remember every detail of that day so this person really miss you a lot and they remember every detail of the day they last met you they last saw you they last felt the feeling of uh, getting married to you or something let's see the oracle guidance around it let's see one card from this deck let's see what is it show the world the real you for some of you you could be dealing with an aquarius as well um or you really need to know that one thing that you are capable of having whatever you desire with this person don't give up yet on this connection that you have with your person no matter what the current circumstances are you really have to believe in your magical power that uh, you do have um and you have to you know shine bright for the world to see that yes you manifested it no matter how hard it seems right now where your your peers may be like you know telling you why don't you give up on this connection why don't you just leave this person why don't you do this that no show them that you are the creator and you are going to create the life that you desire with your person so don't give up yet on this connection so yeah that's pretty much it coming up from your person uh in this week so yeah if it was of help do like and subscribe if you are willing to purchase any of the services that i offer check the description box for further details on that and yeah till i do the next read for you guys um take care and bye bye and um you can also uh check out the manifestation tools and techniques that i offer if you want to purchase any of them you can check the description box for further details on that as well so till i do the next read take care bye